This tutorial is going to explain how to install the Action Pro Studio as well as how to load the Action Illustrated Clipart into it. First off, you want to make sure that you have Corel Draw version X6, X7, or X8. It needs to be a full version of Corel Draw. It cannot be an academic or educational version. This does not work in any other versions of Corel Draw or any other vector graphics program. Go ahead and insert your Action Pro Studio CD. This should prompt the Action Apps installer. If your computer does not automatically do that, just go ahead and go to your computer's devices and drivers where you can see your DVD drive and double click on it. Here's the Action Apps installer. You'll see that you have two different install options. If you have a 32-bit version of CorelDRAW, you're going to install this 32-bit version of the Action Apps. If you have a 64-bit version of CorelDRAW, you will need to install the 64-bit installation setup. You can tell the version of CorelDRAW you have right in the name. You can see I have X7 and XA over here. If it says 64-bit in parentheses after the version of CorelDRAW, you have the 64-bit. If it just says the name of CorelDRAW, like if it just said CorelDRAW X7 with nothing after it, then you have the 32-bit version of Corel. So once you know which install to run, simply click on that setup. You will need to have CorelDRAW closed while you do this. This is a very fast installation. Just click Next, Next, and then Finish. Once you have that installed, go ahead and open up CorelDRAW. An activation window will automatically pop up in the center. If the activation window does not, you can manually open it inside of CorelDRAW by going to the Action Apps Help and clicking on the License Activator. You will need to input your company's information. Do not include any specialty symbols like an ampersand or an exclamation point. If you have an ampersand symbol in your company name, You'll just need to replace it with the actual word A and AND. Select the product to either the Pro Studio ZX3 or Pro Studio ZWE, depending on what the first three letters of your activation serial number is. There's actually no difference between the two softwares listed, it's just a matter of which code you were assigned. Then enter your activation serial number from inside your DVD box. Use all uppercase letters and include the dashes. This code is good for two computers. The activation will require an internet connection. After that, you will notice these new purple icons right inside of CorelDRAW. Now, we can go ahead and import the Action Illustrated clip art. If you happen to have used the Action Illustrated Instant Designer software on this same computer, that you just installed the Action Pro Studio, you will not need to import your clipmate. You should just be able to go ahead and click on the template browser and see all of your artwork already here. However, if this computer has never had the Instant Designer, you will need to import the clip art. Go ahead and insert one of your Action Illustrated clip art disks into your computer or plug in your Action Pack flash drive. Then click on the Import CD button here. You're going to browse for your clipart CD in your computer's disk drive or navigate to the flash drive. On your flash drive, you will select one of the volumes listed. You will need to import each volume separately. Do not try and import the entire collection all at once. Make sure you see the book title right here and then click import to start the process. It will take about 15 to 20 minutes per volume to load them into the system, but it's only going to need to be done once for each computer. If you ever get the error message override existing files, just click no. It means you already have that artwork installed on your computer. There we go. After you installed your artwork, you're ready to start using the Action Pro Studio. The Action Pro Studio can only be installed onto two computers at once. If you would like to move 
the Action Pro Studio from one computer to a new computer, you can deactivate it from an existing activated computer. You'll simply go to the Action Apps Help and then click on the License Activator. This is going to bring up that Action Apps License Activation window. Make sure the product is selected on whichever Pro Studio uh, you have and then you'll click on Deactivate. Now you will be able to install the Action Pro Studio onto a different computer using the same activation serial number. This is also where you can activate additional Action Illustrated software. The software we, that we just installed, the Action Apps, includes three different products, the Pro Studio, the Easy Gem, and the Easy Stitch digitizing software. If you have purchased the Easy Gem software or the Action Easy Stitch, simply bring up this license activator window and change the product to either that of that product and enter in your activation serial number. You will then see the corresponding toolbar come up right inside of your Corel Draw.